guys this place is so beautiful the security here is so tight hello guys it's your girl malika again and today i'm not going to say welcome and welcome back to my channel today i just want to tell you guys stay tuned stick till the end of this video guys because what you are doing today is something very very interesting and today's video is an adventurous video you know we have started going places as we said 2022 is the year of traveling yes we started traveling the world and guys uh, we are using SGR for the very very first time not only using SGR for the very first time also this is the very first time ever going to Mombasa yes county 001 stick until the end of this video don't miss anything as I'm, I'm going to explain to you and to give you details on my first ride on my first SGR ride guys stay tuned guys apparently we have stopped at Kibwezi because the, <laughs> we are having an emergency necessary apologies for the inconvenience I've never traveled to Mombasa uh, so this being the first time uh, people are saying like are you going by bus you know like you can take the SGR the standard gauge railway that is that's what I mean by SGR the standard gauge railway and so far so good uh, even if you are stuck here at Kibwezi uh, the journey has been smooth until here so, hey guys welcome and welcome back to my channel it's your girl Malika it's yet another beautiful beautiful day somewhere in Nairobi County yeah I came back from the village like two days ago and I'm traveling again mm, this vlog I was supposed to start this vlog in the house but I didn't have enough time so this vlog is starting here in an uber so guys finally we are going to Mombasa using SGR uh, for the very first time my very first time experience using SGR and as you know guys I have to share my experiences with you so if you haven't subscribed to this channel kindly consider subscribing join this amazing amazing YouTube family and let's grow together guys so I wanted to show you parking in the house but guys honestly I didn't have time I didn't have time today um, I was feeling tired exhausted so yeah let me show you <laughs> my journey to Mombasa starting from where I am right now I'm heading to SGR station in Siokimao Mombasa Road so yeah let's get there let me show you let me show you around before we get there so guys when you're going to Mombasa Road either when you're going to the airport or to SGR station you have to leave early like this is traffic at 11 a.m. in Nairobi and we are we are in, on Tika Road we are not even on Mombasa Road yet so if you're traveling from this side you have to be careful because you'll be late you'll be late if you if you're not careful if you're not keen you'll be late because now like i didn't expect to find traffic on thika road but now just look at this guys we're finally here this is the entrance i don't even know if i'm supposed to film but so guys i'm finally here um I'm from scanning my bags. I'm not allowed to film while there. So I'm going to print my ticket right now. It's early. It's 11 and my my train leaves here at at 3 p.m. So I'm too early right now. But let's go print our ticket. Guys, this place is so beautiful. The security here is so tight guys uh so this is where i was supposed to print but i was looking for these machines i couldn't find them but uh i've just printed at the reception this is my ticket uh, i can't see it clearly this is my ticket it's just something small and yeah we have like so many boots one two three four five six seven so we are now going to wait outside guys outside 
guys, apparently I'm supposed to leave here at 3 p.m. But I'm already here and it's a few minutes to 12. <laughs> I'm too early. Uh, I was supposed to do something in town before coming here. But I finished earlier than I expected. So I decided to just come, you know, like because it, since it's my first time, I can just come and do my things earlier. I already have my ticket with me here. So I just have to wait uh until three until like boarding time yeah because the train leaves at 3 p.m and so guys uh, i'm starving right now i don't know where to buy something i don't even know if they have a restaurant over here but i'm going to ask around in the meantime let me give you a tour around the sgr uh nairobi terminus come with me natural also like I don't like doing makeup like putting on a lot of makeup on my face when I'm traveling so just the natural everything natural uh, we're going to do something as soon as we re we reach Mombasa as soon as we arrive yeah so in the meantime um, I'm trying to find where a place where I can buy food because I'm starving I just woke up like showered prepared everything and left the house without eating anything I'm starving man, I'm starving right now. Let me find let me find where I can eat first. So guys, actually I wanted to eat something before I left and I've been told uh, I have like to take my to take my bags first because it's time I can't access the restaurant before like uh, what do you call it entry time so because the restaurant is just near the waiting bay so I'm going to take my bag uh, then go with my bags so yeah yeah guys this is the parking lot this is the parking area it's so huge I'm telling you it's so huge comes all the way to this side and this is the like the SGR station yeah so this is the checkpoint we have to pass through here this white house like thing guys i'm starving i'm starving guys the sun is too hot also in nairobi i thought bungoma is the only hot place right now but turns out nairobi is also too hot like too hot but we don't give up we have to travel so Guys, we're waiting for the, for the security people to bring the sniffer dog so that I can, like, you know, the security checkpoint, check our luggage and everything so that we can proceed inside. I can't wait to get to the waiting bay so that I can eat something. I'm really starving, I'm really starving. And everyone here is minding their own business. I feel like, you know, like, my, my that's why I'm like, I don't want to shout. having so I decided to buy something small something that I can bite don't want to buy food inside the train so this is what I bought crisps and mango juice this is my African bag here carried my African bag representing We are going to board like this is the economic class a lot of people are boarding right now uh, let me show you how it looks like from behind <laughs>
you. guys know that the SGR station there is this part of the SGR station whereby it passes through a national park yes there is this place where it passes through a national park and in 9 out of 10 times you use the SGR you can get to see like some wild animals maybe the elephant lion if you're lucky enough in my case I didn't see any but I hear like in most cases you get to see animals you know zebras yeah that's the most interesting part like when you're going to Mombasa you also get a chance to see wild animals if you've never seen wild animals before this could be your only chance this could be another chance because uh, the SGR passes right in between Savo National Park yeah whereby um uh, you get to see different animals and you know like uh nature 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 uh you can see there is a place where there is uh the sgr passes between a forest like a for not a really big forest but uh where whereby like in between a national park that's just like a forest just that it's different because there's not so many trees but uh yeah it's it for Kibwezi. Mm. so guys apparently we have stopped at Kibwezi because the, <laughs> we are having an emergency repair apparently the railway like the rail itself has a, the, the track has a problem has been spoiled so they are carrying out the emergency repair right now so we are going to delay for some time we are not sure we are going to delay for how long whether one hour two hours or three hours so we are just here waiting uh, hmm, yeah we we'll see how it goes actually the train was supposed to leave Nairobi at 3 p.m and it left exactly at 3 p.m so that by 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 8 by 8 p.m we are supposed to be in Mombasa so, so guys my fingers are crossed I hope you're going to reach Mombasa early because um I don't know exactly where I'm going and I don't want to keep my friend for so long waiting for me so <sighs> let's see how long it's gonna take in the meantime let me show you how this train looks like on the inside stay tuned <laughs> Guys, I've decided like, to take a walk inside the train and see what's on the other side. Uh, this side is like empty, empty, empty. It's locked, but let me show you how it looks from where I'm standing. I'm walking inside the train. Uh, I don't know if I should show you or how it looks like or... So one thing that I love about this train is that it's super fast comparing to like traveling to Mombasa by road because uh, initially we used to travel to Mombasa by road and I've never traveled to Mombasa uh, so this being the first time uh, people are saying like are you going by bus you know like you can take the SGR the standard gauge railway that is that's what I mean by SGR the standard gauge railway and so far so good uh, even if you are stuck here at Kibwezi uh, the journey has been smooth until here and yeah, I think I like it I would use the SGR once again um, I'm gonna tell you how it, it's going to be uh, from until when we get to Mombasa in the meantime let me give you a tour inside the SGR I hope you enjoy Sincerely apologize for the inconvenience. Thank you for your patience. Guys, uh, so far so good. The SGR was okay. Uh, you can see how the seats are arranged. Uh, the one thing, one good thing about the SGR is that it's very, very clean inside and they keep on cleaning each and every time. You can see this place is clean. It's one and a half later. Now we've left Kibwezi. Hmm. 
the inconvenience has like delayed for one and a half hours. So <laughs> let's see. Of course, we're going to be late. One and a half hours, we're going to be late, of course. So, but still hoping for the best. Uh, I hope this is not how the SGR behaves on a daily basis. But let's see how the rest of the journey is going to be. Uh, so far, so good. It's dark outside. I'm gonna show you in a minute. So, yeah. And uh, yeah, people as Kenyans are very social. Kenyans are very social. You can't get bored traveling via sgr you know like you make friends like for example i made a friend on the sgr i made a friend inside the train i went alone but i made a friend you know a friend who even assisted me with a camera like how good is that you know i had to vlog for you guys i had like to get a nice footage for you guys and so i got some company and this friend of mine really came in for me assisted me with ho with my camera and i really really appreciated so guys this is how the sgr looks on the inside yes we have a restaurant inside the sgr train we have a restaurant and this is the restaurant this is the restaurant we also have food i bought some food in the sgr milk and chapati milk was going for uh one dollar that is a hundred shillings and chapati was 50 shillings that is like um half a dollar guys uh, my experience in the sgr was okay except the part that the train uh we had some issue there there was some technical issues whereby the rail was vandalized somewhere and yeah uh, we had to stop for like two uh, hours or one and a half hours for the you know the people responsible to repair because they said if we continued with the journey we couldn't it could have caused the train to derail so we had to delay for like one and a half hour approximately to wait, wait for the rail to be repaired and off we went off we went to mombasa uh so far so good my experience was awesome i loved my experience with the sgr being a first timer uh i think it was awesome it was awesome guys and you know everything is accessible they have toilets they have uh everything is accessible and um it takes approximately five hours from nairobi to mombasa which is a good thing because by car by a bus it takes more than that and i think it's okay it's okay you don't get so tired guys finally we are in mombasa county 001 representing it's a bit late but we thank god we got here safe and sound <laughs> Guys, we're finally here after like six hours instead of five hours, but the experience was good. That was our train. That was our train. Now I have to take the motorbike to my destination um, to surprise my friend, you know. It was her birthday i didn't make it to come on time so i told her i won't make it to come but right now i just can't wait to see her and celebrate with her because uh i haven't seen her for like two years in two years so i know she's going to be very very happy to see me yeah that is my train hey <laughs> bless me kubo vizuri We are in Mombasa. This is the Mombasa station. It's so full than Nairobi. Just look at people traveling at night. This place is so packed. <laughs> 